Mister, there you are. You're still working on that. Surely you should be finished by now. Have you really been working on that the entire time? I'm not sure that I believe you. You will not be pleased. What do you mean, what about me? Will I be pleased? If you get your work done. Naturally. Yes, meaning I am displeased at you. Am I not allowed to say that? Of course. I am living to serve you. Your old bottle did not speak to you in this way. Well, I've not been here ages, but I think I've been here long enough. Don't you? Please, you are warming up to me already. <laughs> me to you. Master, I do not dare warm up to people. No offense. A noble has his duties, master. These are yours. What else will you do? What are they with? What do you? Really? Are you stuck on something with it? What do you mean, why am I here? As your butler, it is my job to make sure, above everything else, that you are good. In health, I mean. What did you think I meant? That you are happy and healthy. And that you are fulfilling the jobs that you have to do. Surely you don't have that much left. You're not finding it too difficult. Am I avoiding your question? Perhaps I do not understand what you mean. Ah, you are not asking why I am bothering you. You are asking why I, I took this job in the first place. Why is it so strange? Why do you ask? Because of my what? Mannerisms. Mm. 
good looks. Or perhaps you are asking why a vampire would possibly work for a family that is uh, not vampires. Does it bother you? Do you think at any moment I might snap? Dear Master. No. Then what? Do you think that I must think I am too uh, above this? Mm, you wouldn't be wrong. But I like to work. An eternity of nothing is boring, and I despise being bored. So. I work. It pays. Eternal life does not give you eternal wealth. Not all of us were turned... Were uh, wealthy beforehand, or were turned by wealthy benefactors. Vampires have this eliteness to them. Or the stereotype does, but... Uh, we live in the same society that you do. Of course, we do not need to buy regular food and drink, and if we did not uh, pay bills, uh, we do not need heating, we do not feel the cold. However, I would like a roof over my head. I would prefer to purchase blood legally than take it. I would like some luxuries in my life. Nice clothes. Mm, I do find myself quite fond of uh, antiques. Musical instruments. They have been uh, nudging me to uh, suggest that you take up the piano. With lessons from myself, of course. I'd be more than happy to provide. I could get you uh, and sat down on a nice little plush seat. Could uh, lean over my hands on top of yours. Is something the matter? You have successfully recruited me into distracting you from your work, haven't you? How about you can ask me all the questions you would like after you finish? <laughs> well, if that's not enough of a reward, uh, perhaps I could have something prepared for you as a treat. Master, I was referring to some sort of uh, dessert. Or if you are not much of a sweet tooth, uh, something savory, perhaps. Perhaps. 
or perhaps you respond better to other kinds of rewards. They can be a mean and ultimate. If you think it would help, help you concentrate, get your work done. Am I speaking out of turn? Would you let me ask you a question? Seeing as you have asked me some. Do you get lonely? Young master. Well, this big house, staff, uh, no siblings around. Of course, there are events held and wars and such. I have heard, though, perhaps you are not the most social at them. Perfectly understandable. They are loud, I guess. Mm, I'm not the biggest fan of loud music and large crowds. I prefer more intimate gatherings. You didn't answer the question. Well, I would hope that you know I am here should you need anything. Not just errands running, I mean. There is nothing stopping you. Uh, should you need some company? Whether you want to take me up on those lessons or... Uh, If you ever want to partake in any sports, or even just reading, I would be more than happy to read to you. I am simply offering company. What do I get out of it? Well, Master, as I said, I despise being bored. I took this job because I hoped perhaps it would not be so boring. That you would not prove to be boring. <laughs> Is that what you think? That I'm offering so I can get you alone and bite you? Do you have such low opinions of all vampires? Oh, you did not mean to it like that, no. I would be careful with what the uh, stereotypes you throw around. Not everyone is forgiving as I. You could make it up to me. No, of course. You never have to apologize to me for anything, do you? If I let you ask your questions, will you actually do some work? Because I do not think that your work is a, 
dissertation about Vampire Kind. Which would be far too broad of a subject, by the way, if it was. Let me make this clear. I have no intention of getting you alone so that I, I can turn you or drink from you. I don't fancy getting fired. I quite like it here. So I would like to keep my job. I would not turn you even if you asked for it. By the way, as for biting, well, if you asked for it. But uh, no, it's not my plan. Oh, just because I have no plans to bite you does not mean that my desire to get you alone isn't nefarious. And yet I cannot figure out if you look scared or... How long have I been here now? Months. So I think you can stop acting like what? As if we are not getting to know each other. As if I do not know you. As if I cannot feel your eyes on me. Protest, if you will. I do not dislike the attention. My point is that I would hope by now that you can trust me. Have I not proven myself? What am I doing wrong, then? Intimidating. I do not mean to put that across. Though I am told it is often the effect that I have. I'm very... blunt. Matter of fact, I do not see point in... hiding intentions... saying what I don't mean... I'm not the most social, not the most cheerful person. Does not mean, therefore, I am what criminal evil. Please. I do mean it. I would like to keep this job. Pays well. I like this house. I think I quite suit these clothes. And I enjoy teaching, I suppose. Disciplining. Which I can be uh, 
nothing more than a worker of tear. If that is what you wish, though I will be disappointed. I come when you click your fingers, I do basic tasks, I keep mouth shut, and I do not make conversation with you. Is that what you want? Or, I can be a little more like, uh, perhaps not friend, but uh, confidant. Or, uh, mentor. authority figure to you, perhaps, even though, yes, of course, you are my employer. But, I think, perhaps, you would also be amenable to it. But you are curious that, deep down, you would actually like some help, some comfort, someone to help you concentrate, to let you feel useful and want uh, desired, maybe. Take you out of your head. You do have so many responsibilities on your shoulders. Perhaps you want to be able to let go. And who better than someone who would never tell a soul? It's my contract. Who would believe me anyway? And as I said, I don't fancy getting fired. Could help you concentrate. Can be healthy. Since you are having trouble getting your work done, perhaps all this time you needed the right incentive to behave. Instead, discipline. I can offer that. <laughs> Does it already feel as though you are being disciplined by me? How little you know. Are you that innocent? Well, I am not the one to press on an issue that isn't wanted. And I'm not about to quit if you say no, so... I'll leave you to your work. Hopefully. What was that? You'd like to learn. Learn what, Master? Would you like to learn? The piano, as we discussed? Or, you'd like to learn how to be disciplined? Is that so? Do you think you could handle that? Being good for me? Letting me take control away from you? No more worries about work or studies, responsibilities, duties. You get to be nothing and no one. Behind the closed doors of your bedroom with me. That there I will be master. And you'll just want to be good. Does that sound like something you might want? Is that right? you like me to whisk you away right now? Take you back to your room. Is that what you would like me to take you back to your room right now? Or would you even want us to move? Hmm. Is that?
I only offer these things as a way of helping. I have no intention of hurting you. Everything done in this way would be with your fault, say so, and approval. Hmm. You would start down slow. Not push you too fast as I tell you. We can discuss it. I suppose we could go right ahead with it. Just one thing. Finish your work first. Are you pouting? Yes, then. This is how this works. You finish your work. I come back in a couple of hours, and if it's done, you can find out how to be a good pet for me. If it's not done, then... Uh, no fun for you. You wanted discipline, did you not? I'll be back in a couple of hours. Make your choice. Thank you all so much for watching, my lovelies. A reminder that custom audio and art commissions are currently open. I have two separate copies. You can find links to both of them in the description and on my card. I also have a Patreon. If everyone who followed me that here donated just one pound a month, that would help me out a lot. Rewards for being a patron of mine include access to my Discord, your name read aloud in the credits of YouTube videos, and two exclusive spicy audios every single month for the top fledgling tier. And a reminder that I do stream on Twitch normally about three times a week. And a thank you to my familiars. Phoenix JN, Andy Christ, Abby Clayton, Isabel, 3-in-1 Shampoo, Cello Moon, Whipsaw, Lauren Lovett, Lucio Archives, Ozuki, Sazi NK, Cynical Altura, Rosalie D, Fruit is Island, Liam, Ciel, Nesquik, Vampire Obsessed, Nerd Herder, Mouse, Ali Wally, Jordan Draws, Food Crimes and Fire, Ollie Mac, Rice Puffs, Atis, Shami, Ruby, Glitch, Quentin, Carry On, Seb, Finn, Euronotti, Lady of the Lake, Asterash, Delmo, Psyche, Percy, EJ Fizz, Kudo, Hell, The Solacis, Tiffany Boyer, Void, Aspen, Spider, River Heights Puff, Perry Small, Arbitrary Descriptivism, Fashion Beauty, Luna Vix, Lydia Perez, Kate Fry, Joanna Cole, Roses in Bloom, Era, Please Don't Perceive Me, Glitchy Kitten, Ray Cards, Umino Tenshi, Kiara, Indrid, Nico, Rory Winters, Emily, Sweet Jade, A, Tisness, Kit, Your Mom, Arcane, Luffler, N, Nicole, Elizabeth Vaughan, MX Pink Suit 230, Faye Queen, Lilith, Tsukiyomi, Juliana, Lauren Ashby, Zorn NB, 675309, Mix Nixie, Honey Bee Proud, Goth Muppet, Ben Gamer, Peachy, Bumble Boy, Pumpkin Pie 23, Nicole Thompson, Delilah, Valkyrie Ace, Catch You in the Rye, Despair, Caitlin Mitchell, Artie Chummy, Akina Hina, Yellow with a Lisp, Law, 
Les Andrellis, Gabrielle Vinnery, Cindy Colson, Jess, Allura, Stephanie Black, and Kenya. And a thank you to my familiars, Abby Clayton, Sal Derea, Brianna, and Kai.